Me, I've said my own. No. You are more beautiful than all this extra artificial makeup. Eh? Because you are beautifully and wonderfully made. Even this is your hair, self. I don't know the color. Okay. I can't ever eh, remember asking you for your opinion, so keep it. Ah ah. Hey. Is it not you, Sasha, baby? You don't have to ask for my opinion before I draw my opinion anyhow your way, as I like it. As long as it's the gospel truth. Hey. See, Sasha. But wait, oh. Okay. Who broke your heart? Because I know someone broke your heart at some point. Who is he? Hi. Hey. Um, is the boss there? Um, is he expecting you? Yes. Oh, okay. Look at you. Mm. Everywhere. <laughs> huh? One or two minutes of your time. What? Hmm. Auntie Bimpe, what you were doing in there, do you think it is wise? Why are you allowing the devil use you like this? Really? This was the reason you stopped me? And here I am thinking you were coming to apologize. Ah, I apologize then. Why would I be apologizing? For barging into the office unannounced. Ah, hey. Auntie Bimpe. You are the one that's supposed to be apologizing to my dad's wife. You're supposed to be saying sorry morning, afternoon, evening, and night on your knees. Look, look. Girls like me do what we need to do to survive. Hey, Auntie Bibi, but you work in the bank. Yes. As a marketer with a hundred million Naira target, men like your boss would never give me an account without asking for something in return. That one is bad, eh? eh? But it is still not an excuse. Why? Why? Why do I even bother? I mean, this is clearly none of your business. Excuse me, Miss Goody Two Shoes. My shoes are two, and my shoes are good. Yes, come in. Ah, it's you. Um, sir, do you mind if I um, have one or two words with you? Yeah, have a seat. Oh, thank you. Uh, sir, mm. I am very, very, very concerned about you. You know, these things you do, is it good? You're a married man and as such, a married man. Hey. It's okay. You're fired. Sir? I said, 
You are fired. Bosa, you, you cannot do this. Is it because I'm telling you to respect your wife, your matrimonial home, yourself? You are fired. Ah. Obviously, there is no more respect and boundaries, right? Your father asked me to give you this job, hence I gave you the job. So, it's obvious you don't need it anymore. Ah, sir, but I need my job. I love my job, I like my job, I do my job. You are fired. Ah, fired. Okay. Hey, but, sir. And uh, what about the three month salary you are owing me? You think I pay your salary? Your father does that. You became a liability to him that he begged me to offer you this job. He pays your salary. Go to your father. It is well. The Lord knows best. And one more thing. When you get home, sit your father and school him on how to live in a matrimonial home too. Thank you, sir. I have been fired for speaking the truth, persecuted for standing up for righteousness. No one is persecuting you. It's just that you don't know how to mind your business. Eh? It's not everything you see or you hear, you talk. Eh? Well, I guess I told you it's in order. But we'll see, Abby. I'll miss you, sweetie. Oh, I miss you too, <laughs> Sasha. Okay, my friend. That's your name, eh? I will like to some move. I can't. Let me just teach you it. Shoge for long. Shoge for long. Let me show you, like, okay, like when you package for God, you, ah, ah. you, you demo, hey. you, you, you do demo for God, you shakara for ah, God. Ah, so you know that like, the full package of God, yeah, you, I'm always looking good for all these I colors that for God. Ah, you know, nah. yes. My friend, my friend. Ah, I miss you. <laughs> I miss you too. Hi, okay. Bye bye. Don't buy that your package. Any matter what she do, so she know the lucky like correction. No, put everybody for confusion. Yeah. In any matter what she do, so now she the correct person. Now she the correct person.